simpler leather jacket carpaccio. Okay, so this is our leather jacket. It's all yes. been skimmed and, and filleted. Yep. And Beautiful. And taking the bones, everything off, so it's uh, everything off. First, Tetsuya slices the leather jacket fillet into slivers. Next, he sprinkles on a mixture of soya sauce, sweet sake and ginger. Finally, a dash of olive oil and some chives. And have it. Now, health experts recommend you should have up to four servings of seafood a week. And one of the healthiest ways is just like this. Fresh and raw. This is a little humble leather jacket carpaccio. I guess a la... <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Thank you. <laughs> Tetsuya reckons the biggest mistake people make in the kitchen is trying too hard. That carpaccio was so simple, and so is his kingfish shabu shabu. Again, the fish is thinly sliced. Just heat some Japanese stock and throw in some grated radish. While that's simmering, combine rice vinegar, soya sauce, chopped black beans, ginger, lemon juice and sugar to make a dipping sauce. All you do is dunk the fish in the stock for a few seconds, then it's into the dip and into your mouth. When you're working, it becomes much of this. Wow. How is it? It's very good. To top it all off, Tetsuya shows me how to elevate the humble flathead to new culinary heights. On a sheet of foil, place onion, fennel, thyme, garlic, chopped bacon and olive oil. No, no, it looks very straightforward. It looks uh, like something I could even do at home. That, that's all right idea, you know. Then lay the whole flatty on top. So Wrap tightly and pop it into the oven on 230 degrees for about 20 bag. minutes. Bag of goodies. <laughs> the result? You should smell this. It's amazing. It's just awesome. All right. Mm. That is... That is perfect. Right. Wow, that's good. 